What's going on guys? Matt here with TNM Product Reviews coming back at you with another review. Looking at more gear for the AR today. Um, it's going to be a short video. We're only looking at two pieces today and they're very simple. So let me get this off and we'll take a look here uh, before we get started. As you can see, rifle is empty, bolts to the rear, no magazine. So what we're going to be looking at today is my option for a sling. Um, so a couple different options. You have three point, two point, one point slings when you're going with an AR or any rifle in most cases. And for mine, I went with a two point sling. Um, and this is a Vickers style sling from Blue, or Blue Force Gear. It is their Vickers two point padded sling. Mine's all wrapped up here, but as you can see, it's a little thicker there than here. Um, and this is a QD mount sling um really nothing to say nothing too much to say about it you know it's it's a padded two point made out of uh, i believe it's like a nylon denier style material got it in coyote and on my ar told you didn't would see the stock again here's that uh stock from cbc i got and it actually has a QD mount on either side. You just take this plug out and there's a QD behind there. Um, so real simple, pop it in, slings attached. And then on the front, I went with a, another item from UTG and got their M-Lock sling mount. So I'll just pop this off here. There we go. So completely adjustable wherever I want it to go on the rifle. Um, that just seems to be the point that works for me. And I'm straighten my sling back out here. Nice part about those QDs are real simple to hook up. Um, on the Vicker style slings, you have this little tab here. If you pull it, it'll extend the sling out and then I probably won't be able to do this one-handed, but we'll try it. Uh, if you pull it the opposite direction, there we go. It'll pull that sling in a little bit. Nice part about that. Put the rifle back on here once. So when you're walking through the woods, military-wise, you're patrolling, you can pull that rifle real nice and close to your body. Obviously, you can't see the lower part of me, but this is just where the rifle lo or hangs. I know some people like to bring that QD mount over and mount it here. I haven't tried it yet, so I don't personally know how I'm gonna feel about it. But if for some reason you need to engage, you bring your target up, you can loosen up that rifle sling, lock it in, and you're ready to roll. So, real simple, let it hang. Pull that sling back down, simple as that. So, uh, just real simple setup, nothing fancy. Uh, the Blue Force Blue Force Gear Vickers two point sling goes for fifty six ninety eight on Amazon. Link in the description below. The UTG Pro M Lock Standard QD Swivel Sling Swivel Adapter, which is that little piece on the front. Uh, that is made out of machine 16, six, or 6061 T6 aluminum. Comes with the M-Lock mount, the, or the M-Lock screws, and it runs 14.19, so it's real cheap. Good setup, it's sturdy, it hasn't come loose. It's, you know, I mean, it's aluminum, it's just like everything else. I haven't had a problem with it. Fits your standard size QD mounts. Real simple, you can mount it anywhere on your M-Lock that you have. It gives you a nice setup. I'm gonna show you guys a little trick too. You stretch your sling all the way out. Okay, lay it flat against your rifle. Line your two sides up down this side. Bring it around, mount it to your handle. So your pistol grip there. Now, it's kind of a pain and I'm gonna try to I'm going to adjust mine here to make it a little easier for me. Give me just a second here. Make 
shorten mine up a little bit. So down around and you get it up over your pistol grip. Lock that in. That keeps your two point Vicker style slings out of the way, but it does not interfere with the use of the rifle. So you still have full control, still actuate everything. So that allows you to store this rifle. Mine stays obviously beside my nightstand in most cases. How tight or loose you make it. I usually have mine cinched down a little better here. It won't move. All you do when you're ready, grab this tab, rip it to the rear. That'll drop your sling. You can mount up and use the rifle as normal if you need to. So cool little tip for you is at the end there. All right guys. That's all I got for you here today. So that was the uh, Blue Force Gear Vickers 2 Point and the UTG Pro M-Lock QD Swivel Adapter. If you like the content you're getting, hit that like button, drop a comment in the comment section below. Let me know what slings you're running. Um, what position you like your QD mounts. Let me see, I wanna try to figure out a different way to run it, possibly in the future. Try some different things out. But that's all I got for you guys. Um, hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you know when we're dropping new videos. Later.